Hello everyone, welcome to the solid edge drafting tutorials. In this tutorial, we will learn solid edge drafting tables option from which in this video we will learn whole table. Here we have one part on which we have used different features of whole like counter bore, tap, counter sunk and dovel fold. So we will use whole table for these whole features. Let's start with drafting. File, new, drawing of active model. Select template and place view. We will take top view. Okay. And side view. Escape. Now, in this ribbon area, we have tables here. First is part list, and second is whole table. Just take this whole table. And here we have some options. First option is normal. Just keep this as it is. In this, we have two options. First is by user selection, and second is by drawing view. First, we will see by drawing view. Select this. Now, first step is to select origin. We can define origin to any whole location or any other feature. We will define origin to this corner. Just select lines and place X and Y. Now second step is to select view and click OK. Here we have whole table for this view with the option of by drawing view. Next we will see with user selection. Take this whole table command. Select here by user selection. Define origin again. Now we have to select holes one by one like this or we can drag all the holes at a time and click OK. Same whole table we have here. If you want to remove or skip some holes from this whole table for that select this whole table click on this select add or remove holes press shift and select holes which we want to remove or skip just click ok we can see here these two holes are removed from this list we have some more options in properties so select this whole table go to the properties here in general save setting we will configure this whole table as per our requirement and we will save the settings for the future drafting work. We can name this setting like sky height draft table. And just save. Here is the height of this whole table. We can control this height with the number of rows, for example, three. It will come in three rows or we can control with the length of this table both this is 100 and maximum height is 50 mm apply we have 50 mm table here and one additional page is added here if we try to enter here 50 third additional page will be added so we have three additional pages we will keep this up to 300 apply here we have table and second option is location here anchor corner we have four options top left top right bottom left and right so we will keep this top left and keep this all settings as it is next option in property is title here we can add title for this whole table just click on this add title and enter name here for example sky high draft table here position header footer both and either we will keep this to header we can select font from this for example arial 
फाइल साइज अंडरलाइन और नॉट अलाइनमेंट सेंटर और लेफ्ट और राइट वी विल कीप दिस एट सेंटर एंड अप्लाई फिर वी कैन सी वी हैव एडेड टाइटल ब्लॉक फॉर दिस होल टेबल वी कैन चेंज टू द फुटर एज वेल अप्लाई दिस इज एट फुटर नाउ अप्लाई नेक्स्ट ऑप्शन इज कॉलम हेयर वी हैव फोर कॉलम्स होल एक्स वाई एंड साइज इफ यू वॉन्ट टू एड होल कॉल आउट एंड साइजेस एंड टाइप ऑफ दिस होल फॉर दैट जस्ट सिलेक्ट प्रॉपर्टी लाइक होल कॉल आउट एंड क्लिक ऑन एड कॉलम एंड जस्ट अप्लाई वी कैन सी होल कॉल आउट कॉलम इज एडेड इन दिस होल टेबल ऑल्सो वी कैन एड टाइप ऑफ होल एड कॉलम एंड अप्लाई type of hole is also added here now here we have some column formats like show column column width header position and row height of the column so for example we will select this whole call out if you want to hide whole call out from this whole table just uncheck this box and apply now whole call out is is not showing here in this whole table select this again and apply it will show again we can control width of this column from this for example 75 and apply 100 apply also header position this one we will take this header or footer apply this it is coming to the footer position we will take this again to header apply height of the row we can change from this for example 10 and apply it is changing here for this header also we want to change name for this whole call out we can change name from this whole type call out for example and apply now name will be changing here so this is all about column format next option is data click on this data here we have complete data for this whole table we can change or manipulate data from this just select column if you want to change font we can change font from this for example italic bold underline this and orientation like center apply we can see here we have selected options reflecting on this whole table also we can delete column from this delete column control z or add column cancel this go to the properties again and data so this is all about data we can add column or rows in this data also we can overwrite on this data just right click on cell allow cell overwrite and enter value here for example 250 apply 250 will come here so this is all about data next each sorting we can sort our data by ascending or descending order with the help of these columns for example x ascending order apply this now this data will be organized with the ascending we can select next option for this y descending order how this will be changed for the y descending order also size ascending apply this next is options here we have options list whole by size just click this and apply we can see whole sizes are noted by a b c and d that means 
a has different size b has different size and c has different size so all holes are organized by type of hole so this is option so we will keep this list by origin and apply now this is one two three four five six seven eight next is hole number we can change hole number from this for example a and now apply this will be a1 a2 a3 a4 and so we can rename anything like a.1 and apply now this will be a.1.1 next is unit now this is mm unit we can change to this inches click apply now this is in inches we can round up this with trailing or leading zeros we can see here trailing decimals are increased up to three decimals apply this up to two up to seven apply we can see this is updated for seven decimals two and mm apply next is whole call out so we will keep this as it is and smart depth as well we have saved this setting once again we will save this save click ok and ok select this whole table and delete go to the whole table again select any option from this now we will select by drawing view define origin now select here whole table template just we have saved as a setting and select view click ok and place whole table here now we can see whole table is as per our requirement just we have saved setting for this whole table so this is all about whole table in solid edge drafting hope have you enjoyed this video please like share and subscribe for more updated videos thank you